हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी चैप्टर फोर दैट इज मनी बिफोर सॉल्विंग द प्रैक्टिस क्वेश्चंस वी शुड हैव बेसिक नॉलेज ऑफ कॉइंस एंड नोट्स काउंटिंग द टोटल मनी एंड मनी नीडेड और लेफ्ट आफ्टर शॉपिंग एक्टिविटीज लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द प्रैक्टिस क्वेश्चंस Govind went to a stationery shop. He bought books for seventeen rupees and pen for seven rupees. If he gave the shopkeeper fifty rupee note, then how much amount of change did he get back? Answer is option B. As seventeen plus seven is equals to twenty four, and he gave fifty rupee note, so balance is twenty six rupees. Rahul has one eighty five rupees. He wants to buy the xylophone of two twenty five rupees. How much more money does he need to buy the xylophone? Answer is option D because money needed is two hundred and twenty-five minus one hundred and eighty-five is equals to forty. What would be the total cost of given lollipops and balls? Answer is option C. Because for lollipops five into two is equals to ten, and for balls three into ten is equals to thirty, so total will be forty rupees. Karan bought five notebooks for five rupees each, and two pencils for two rupees each. How much he has to pay? Answer is option B because for notebooks five into five is equals to twenty five, and for pencils two into two is equals to four. Total is twenty nine rupees. The box of chocolates is given. Which of these can be find out from the information given on it? Answer is option D because net quantity is ten. Option A is true. Cost written on the box is ten, so option B is correct. But cost of ten chocolates is not ten rupees. It's hundred rupees. Hence option C is false. A box of one kg apples costs one fifty rupees. What will be the cost of three such boxes? Answer is option B, because one kg is for one fifty, and three kg is equal to three multiplied by one fifty is equal to four fifty. Deepak has forty-eight rupees. How much money will be left with him if he buys two ice creams, two chocolates, one pen, and one burger? Answer is option D. Because ice cream costs ten rupees, chocolate costs ten rupees. Pen costs seven rupees. One burger costs ten rupees. So total will be thirty-seven rupees. Balance will be forty-eight minus thirty-seven is equals to eleven. 
Jayadeep has the money shown below to spend on snacks at the movie. Which two things can he buy with the money? Answer is option C because he has 35 rupees. Shubham had the money shown below in his piggy bank. His father gave him the money shown below. What is the total amount of money he has all together? Answer is option B because he had 600 rupees and his father gave him 2100 rupees. So total is 2700 rupees. At the craft fair, Saurabh sold toy cars like the one shown here. He sold each car for 265 rupees. How much money did he make? by selling six such cars. Answer is option D because total is 265 into 6 is equal to 1590. Priya collected 80 rupees to buy a teddy bear. Teddy bear costs 50 rupees. Which of the following she can buy along the teddy bear from the amount she has? Answer is option B because she left with 30 rupees. So she can buy only teddy's comb. A water bottle costs 37 rupees. Find the cost of 9 such water bottles. Answer is option C. Because 37 into 9 is equal to 333. How much will 750 gram of peaches cost? Answer is option D. See here, 500 grams is for 8 rupees. For 750, we need 250 grams more, which is half of 500. So, 250 grams for 4 rupees and 750 gram will be for 12 rupees. A video game costs 2550 rupees. Sonia save 150 rupees every week. How many weeks she will take to save money to buy the video game? Answer is option D. Ideally, we should divide 2550 by 150. But what I did here, I multiplied 150 with every option and got 17 multiplied by 150 was the game's cost. That is 2550. Namita goes to a mall with 200 rupees and saw the given prices of few items. Which of the following items she can take so that no amount is left with her? Answer is option B. Because Cost of purse and necklace is exactly 200 rupees. So that 
no amount is left with her. Vikas bought 80 ice cream bricks for a party. The total cost of bricks was 640 rupees. Cost of one ice cream brick is Answer is option B. Because option A and D are greater than the total cost. So both of them are wrong. 8 into 80 is equal to 640. So option B is correct. Rajesh bought a water bottle for 25 rupees and a lunch box for 65 rupees. If he gave a 100 rupee note to the shopkeeper, then how much did he get in return? Answer is option D. Total cost will be 25 plus 65 that is 90. And 100 minus 90 is 10. Sid has 500 rupees. He bought two CDs, a toy car and a book. How much money will be left with him? Answer is option B. Because two CDs costs 100 rupees, toy car costs 45 rupees, book costs 95 rupees, total is 240. Sid has 500 rupees. So balance amount will be 500 minus 240. That is 260. If Shika bought 6 shirts each for 200 rupees, then how much change does she receive if she gave 2000 rupees to the shopkeeper to pay including the offer given in the image? Answer is option A. Let's see. Six shirts will cost 1200 rupees and offer says buy three shirts and get back 100. So she will get discount of 200 rupees. Total bill will be 1000. Change will be 2000 minus 1000 is equals to 1000. If 3 pencils plus 1 sharpener is equal to 16 rupees, 2 sharpeners plus 2 erasers is equal to 14 rupees and 3 erasers is equal to 9 rupees, then the cost of 1 pencil is... Answer is option A. Let's check. As per the third statement, 3 erasers for 9 means 1 eraser for 3. So, second statement becomes 2 sharpeners is equal to 14 minus 6 is equal to 8. So, 1 sharpener will be for 4 rupees. Hence, first statement becomes 3 pencils is equal to 16 minus 4 is equal to 12. So, 1 pencil is equal to 12 by 3 is equal to 4. That's all for today. In the next video, we will study the 5th chapter. For that, subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so you will get the notification. Thanks for watching. Do share with your friends. Have a nice time.